Philanthropy Connections is a charitable organization. Our philosophy is that we try to find local organizations who do excellent work for the communities. They know the people, they know the culture, they speak their language, and they are ideally placed to help their communities. What we do is we visit these organizations. We want to know exactly what is going on, and we have a set of criteria. The criteria by which we measure the effectiveness and the efficiency of the organization. In Cambodian villages, eight out of 10 people do not have a toilet, which means that children and family members must go outside in the field. Due to frequent flooding, many are at high risk of getting sick, with many children dying before they are five years old from preventable diseases like diarrhea, hepatitis A and typhoid fever. There is, however, a simple and sustainable solution. Philanthropy Connections finances toilets for families in many villages and educates the villagers on good hygiene practices. This is one of the ways in which we support local communities because the use of a toilet leads to better health and an improved quality of life, school attendance and work performance will increase. We support our trusted partner, KAKO, a Cambodian non-profit organization that focuses on community development, education, health and hygiene projects in impoverished villages around Siem Reap. Since 2015, KAKO has run a tertiary scholarship program to help determined secondary school graduates pursue a higher education. This program provides students with university tuition. One of our scholarship students, Dok Shrey Ni successfully completed secondary school in November 2015 and is our first tertiary scholarship program student. Dok Shrey Ni and her siblings live in a small house in a rural village not far from Siem Reap. Her mother died in 2007 and not long afterwards her father left them to remarry and the children were left on their own. I'm absolutely delighted with all the support that we have received so far and I am sure that with that kind of support that hopefully will grow in the future, we can do much more for more projects who help people in vulnerable situations to build a more dignified life for themselves.